Number one, um, my career means a lot to me. I love my career. I love teaching. And um, I worked very hard to get my master's degree and uh, to be a career woman. So it was one of those things when I was pregnant the first time, I thought, oh, this is going to be a tough one because I, you know, I do enjoy, I do enjoy my career and um, moving up that ladder. And um, I did, was able to juggle with uh, my first child. I went to a daycare that was very close. It was a home daycare and I felt very comfortable. Still, you know, I felt like that was a, a wonderful decision. At the time, um, I had my second child, um, Paige, then too, when I was teaching um, full time. And a, a part of me was starting to feel like, wow, maybe, maybe, uh, you know, I, I love my teaching, but maybe I can put this on hold for just a little bit. Um, and be, I was, uh, what's called an honors teacher, gifted and talented teacher, I became a specialist and my, my principal was fantastic. Um, he was very supportive you know, of, of that whole um, change, that whole switch. And so when I became a specialist, my, my hours, I, I uh, wanted more flexible hours. And so I went from the, the classroom to being a specialist. So that kind of worked well and I could balance you know, having two children. And then, um, I don't know, you know, it was kind of one of those things where I, I started looking at this. We were building a new home um, in this area, and uh, I think I started looking at that, uh, looking at motherhood a little bit differently, what I wanted to do with the, the kids were getting older, and um, I was spending a lot of time away from them. And um, it was almost like my situation kind of guided, you know, what, what was what I was, you know, deciding, and in my heart, I kind of felt like maybe I needed to stay home, and um, I think, uh, you know, the situation at the daycare kind of changed a little bit, and my daughter was saying, you know, mommy, I'd like to spend more time with you, so all these things kind of, you know, filtered into that decision, and um, it was really interesting because it was a very tough, you know, tough, tough decision for me to stay home financially, I think is, you know, probably the, the most important one. But um, it was very interesting because upon deciding that, okay, I am going to stay home, I'm going to have to, do, you know, use my pennies, <laughs> you know, really be a good little penny pincher, um, my husband started receiving more um, promotions. And, you know, it was just interesting, you know, where you find, where you can find money, you know, selling a few things on eBay or, you know, this kind of thing. And uh, that really helped my decision to stay home. So. You know, so far that's really worked out. I've been on parental leave for a few years, and I had another uh, child, and um, so far so good. So I don't know. You know, I have a really supportive um, surrounding yourself with supportive people. You know, and, and being in the teaching field itself is um, one of those things that, to me, I think is a. Uh, you know, it just it, it uh, lends itself well to motherhood and you know the balance because people do understand maybe a little bit more of what what's required <laughs> you know, in uh, teaching and then you know, taking care of kids in general.